Hey everyone, um, I'm going to talk a little bit about caffeine and L-theanine during this video. It's a nootropic that is getting a lot of attention. What I'm finding just through reading um, message forums and just looking at, looking at questions, looking at different threads are that there really are no nootropics that are, um, you could say, new to the market in 2019 that people are impressed by, but more so just it's we're seeing that people are recognizing that a lot of the nootropics that um, have been introduced to the market over the past few years are um, just seen as more effective. There's more people trying them. There's more reviews and some of them, there's even more research. And one of those nootropics is uh, the caffeine and L-theanine mix. And um, if you are to purchase them, I would recommend that you do buy them in a, in a capsule itself. If you buy, um, you can, buy caffeine pills very affordably, five bucks for maybe 60 tabs at 200 milligrams, or I'll, and, and then L-theanine, you can buy that in the powder and just weigh it with a scale. Although the simple solution is just buying the capsules. Um, Nootropics Depot sells a capsule which does contain uh, the, um, the ideal ratio. So 100 milligrams of caffeine to 200 milligrams of L-theanine. So that's in essence like a, um, you know, if you are to purchase them separately, you wanna have them in a, in a one to two ratio, right? Let's see if you just one to two ratio. I don't know, sorry, I don't know if that came up. So that's so that's one caffeine to two um, L-theanine. And what I like about it, even just more more than just caffeine itself, is it seems to really just um, lessen any side effects that you may be getting from the caffeine. So this typically for people would be things like. Um, just overstimulation, a little bit of jitteriness, even a crash. And you seem to get this effect from caffeine that most people would report, including myself, is that you are sort of just too stimulated that it does somewhat shut down your emotions. Whereas L-theanine, you can actually notice when your emotions arise, you can feel, you can notice the fact that your mood is slightly uplifted, which is definitely something to pay attention to if your mood is uplifted then everything just you you're not really seeing it with your normal perception right so in essence alphine can really shut off that uh you know shut off that just internal response now what interests me most about this is that it's in itself however i would not recommend you take alphine if you're somebody that um takes a takes caffeine for your pre-workout and just because I'm, I'm finding that in essence, it, it does not in any way enhance the physical stimulant, like the, the physically stimulating effects you get from caffeine, which caffeine people will take for uh, pre-workout for, you know, it'll enhance fat loss. It'll help you with power output. So you'll be able to do more reps. It'll help with your um, aerobic capacity. So you'll be able to do more cardio last for longer and um, just go have, have a more intense workout. So I'm, I'm, some people do re do recommend you, you take L-theanine with your caffeine. Maybe it can help your mindset a little bit. For me, myself, I, I do not. And there's a reason why if you look at most pre-workout products and brands and um, you know s s supplement pre producers who are a lot smarter than I am, they're, they're not putting L-theanine in their pre-workout products. So that kind of does speak for itself. But as far as the nootropic goes, I'm absolutely loving this stuff. There's a lot of research now showing that it, it's, there's um, cognitive tests People are taking tests and they're noticing that it's helping people's working memory, their ability to solve complex problems. And overall, I just, I, I'm, I really like the stuff. I would rate it maybe nine out of 10. Again, for a while, I was just taking the powder and the capsule itself. Maybe I was dosing it wrong, but I wasn't liking it. And now, since I bought the pill, it's very, very, um, since I bought that pill, which encapsulates like caffeine to theanine at the perfect ratio, I'm just really, really enjoying it. I would say even versus caffeine pills itself or versus like an energy drink, I would prefer that. Why? It's zero calorie. Um, you know what you're taking. You're not taking any um, artificial ingredients. And it's just really great for somebody who wants to get things done. It's just get things done, have a nice smooth focus. So your ability to just focus on something for a very long period of time, shut out the distractions, and then as well your ability to like shift your focus and do something else. 
great stuff overall. Um, guys, I hope, you, hope you're finding this uh, channel helpful. Um, I do look at all the comments and maybe your comment could be featured in, in a future video. If there's any question you have, you think it's a good idea for me to cover, then you let me know and I'll look forward to seeing you all next time.